Lulu. I'm about to see the mouth trap at the oh at St. Martin's Theatre on West Street, so that's really exciting. Um, last night I saw Wicked for the first time, which was amazing. I cried. <laughs> um, <laughs> and the set was really gorgeous. And so with the costumes and the songs, but I mean, I only remembered the Defying Gravity song because I've heard that already from Glee. Um, and that song was incredible. So yeah, I'm super excited to watch The Mousetrap um, because I remember having to read it uh, in English Extension 1 with a Mr. Dawson, I do believe. Um, yeah, to read the play. And I remember there being a woman called Felicity who was a tennis player. Oh, wait a minute, that could be the Inspector Hound. Oh, shit. I... Yeah, I might be confusing that with the Inspector Hound. Well, that just got awkward. Moving on. I went to Camden Market today, which was super amazing. Uh, pretty overwhelming, though. There were so many stalls and, like, seriously, like more than one market, there were like at least three or four markets and so many stalls, so many people, so I'm considering going back tomorrow just in case I've missed out on something that I didn't see today. Um, I bought two dresses and a necklace, um, which I'm wearing now, yay. Well, next. And yeah, mm, for a market it was actually expensive, I had to haggle. Um, which was fun. It was fun haggling, but it wasn't fun that things were expensive because I, I don't know. I feel like nowadays markets aren't what they used to be. <coughs> you know what I'm saying? Like back in Marlo, you know, if you would go to a market to get bargains, um, but it just feels like nowadays if you go to a market, they're just selling clothes for the same price that you'd get them in a store. I don't know. But I mean, there's still boot markets, but whatever. That's boring. Um, so yeah, so that's what's happening. Uh, I have no plans for tomorrow or the next few days in London. But I will try to see more shows and I'll try to do more shopping. I really want to go to Topshop. I haven't been to Topshop yet. I'm really, really excited. <laughs> My wallet isn't excited though. Um, yeah, that's about it. I'll just show you a bit. Yeah, about these seats. <laughs> Bought them yesterday. They were £16, which I don't know what that is in dollars, but maybe $30 or $28 or $25, something like that. So, super cheap seats. But, you know, with cheap seats comes altered viewing of the stage, so I guess I've learnt my lesson for paying cheap seats, I'm going to, you know, not get the best view. We'll see what happens, I mean, maybe I will still be able to see quite well. <laughs> we'll see. It's a mystery. Um, yeah, ooh, the hostel that I checked into today, <coughs> that was attractive, um, was a former courthouse and it was only... Uh, changed into a hostel like seven years ago, so that's really interesting. And um, I think I'll take a video there or maybe take some pictures there. It's super cool, like they just haven't changed it at all. It is a courthouse, they've just like put little signs around making it a hostel and they've you know installed beds and a kitchen and whatnot. So that is really cool. Yeah, I don't okay. So, um, today's the 14th. And exactly in two weeks' time, I'll be catching my flight to Sydney. So I don't know whether or not to pop over to Edinburgh for a few days or to just spend more time in London. Help me. I, I, I really don't know. I'm still thinking about it. Um, it's stressing me out a little. Ooh, show's starting. Okay, bye-bye.